Dr. Michael Lang of the Lang Eye Institute's Fortify Vitamins. Remember, this show is dedicated to you, the listener. If you're uh, contemplating giving a call, don't be shy. This is a live call-in show. Remember, no matter how simple or complicated your question is, as long as it's regarding your vision, eye care, or a nutritionally related topic, I'll try to answer it to the best of my ability. We're broadcasting uh, from Genesis Communications here in Largo, Florida, and you can actually watch me live on News Talk Florida. Dot com. So you can go to www.newstalkflorida.com, and you can watch me and hear me anywhere in the world. Just go to your internet uh, and check me out. Also, uh, a variety of radio stations are picking me up. Uh, let's see, it's Atlanta, Georgia, Montgomery, Alabama, uh, just about every uh, city in Florida. Um, the Sky, 97.3 FM, and Gainesville, uh, which reaches all the way up to Georgia and down to about the villages. So you can be heard uh, in the Deep South. I mean, people pick us up from over there in uh, uh, Gulf Shores, Alabama, Orange Beach, uh, certainly Panama City, all the way down to the Keys and up to north of Atlanta and that mountain bike country up around LJ, actually. All right, the so phone lines are open. If you got a question, 866-977-4820. That's 866-977-4820. Um, I do want to mention a few things before we take the first call of the day. Uh, we're running a 40% off summer special at the Lang Eye Institute in the Villages. It's 40% off frames if you buy lenses. So you can bring your prescription. We can duplicate your prescription. You can get an eye exam. But it's 40% off all ophthalmic frames when you buy lenses. It is not doing anything with your insurance. So this is cash. Uh, it's a summer special trying to help you out. That's a pretty good deal, 40% off your frames when you buy your lenses. So that's at the Lang Eye Institute in the Villages. Also, remember, I mentioned this last show. We got a summer special for uh, the Fortify combination of Fortify Superfood and Fortify Super Protein. All right, that special is um, 30% off if you use summer in the promo code. So, summer in the promo code, we're going to have 30% off. All right, um, go to fortify.com, F O R T I F E Y E, kind of a play on words, fortify.com, and you will click on the Fortify Super Protein and the Fortify Super Food, Organic Blue Green Super Food, and put summer in the checkout at the end, and you're going to get 30% off automatically on that. And then lastly, if you're watching me, you're seeing me hold something up that I've been promoting a lot, the Paleo Simplified Bars. These things are great. If you need a bar to give you energy during the day, you want something that has no uh, gluten in it, all right, non-GMO, uh, low glycemic index, Paleo Simplified Bars are great. You can get them on the website at paleosimplified.com. You can get them on Amazon. You can get them on the Fortify website. You can get them at Fortify in Ocala. Just go to the Fortify location right there at 1510 Southwest 17th Street. Uh, you can get the Paleo Bars there. Um, remember, Amazon has them, Fortify.com. Paleo Simplified has them. If you use the code PALEO, all right, uh, in the promo code section on Paleo Simplified on their, their website, you're going to get 20% off when you buy a box of these bars or 20% off when you buy three bags of the Paleo Crunch. So that's a good reason to go to paleosimplified.com and get them versus Amazon. Um, but uh, these are delicious. Oh, we're going to the phones. I uh, gave, let's say, enough coupons for the beginning of the morning. Let's see who's first. I know who it should be. Bob, good morning. Welcome to the program. Good morning, Dr. Lane. Thank you so much for taking my call. Uh, how was your race last weekend, young man? Oh, that was phenomenal. I got to race on 
uh, Sebring Raceway. It was absolutely amazing, an iconic racetrack, and uh, I actually did quite well. I had a time of consistently between 2.27 and 2.30. Uh, you know, the advanced pros, they, they had some guys from France that were running Porsches that were uh, quite tricked out, and they were running uh, low 220s, um, 219, 220, 221, 223, um, and I was running 227, 228. And I was on regular tires, not slicks. The so slicks will give you about four seconds better time. So I got to tell you, I'm going back uh, in three weeks to Sebring, and in two weeks I'm heading to Leeds, Alabama. So everybody in Montgomery that listens to me can come out to Barber Speedway. I'll be there, and I think it's two weeks. I think it's July 6th and 7th or 5th and 6th and 7th, something like that. So it was a lot of fun. It was a safe time. It was a good time. And that new Viper HDR Extreme Voodoo 2 handled amazingly well, and it got a lot of attention. <laughs> good, good. Uh, I just another question in, in that regard. Are your races uh, designed to be within one tank of gas, or do you have to pit stop? You get tires and stuff like that, like the big boys do. Yeah, no, no, not, not at that level yet. These, these races are about a half hour, okay? And so you don't go through a tank of cat, uh, but you do go in, in about two day, two, th- three races that you have to put new tires on. Uh, so these tires are very soft compound. And I got to tell you, the race fuel is quite expensive. You want to bring your own fuel when you go to these tracks because I found out that uh, when you buy race fuel at the track, it's over $10 a gallon. Very much. I'm glad you had success. My question. I have a close friend who has been experiencing a migraine headache that seems to be located behind his left eye consistently. And, um, I mean, the, the migraine varies in intensity, but it's been with him now um, three, maybe four weeks straight. Um, I'm trying to encourage him to see an optometrist, namely a Dr. Lang, but that's up to him. Uh, is, is that a good recommendation for him? Yeah, absolutely. Anytime you have any pain behind the eye, a headache behind the eye, it can be a whole host of different things. I mean, we just go over a few things. Number one, you could ha- he could have elevated pressure in that eye, as in the glaucoma. He could have quite high pressure causing this pain. If he doesn't get it addressed, uh, it could damage the optic nerve and ultimately he can go blind. There's also a condition called optic neuritis. Optic neuritis is an inflammation of the optic nerve. He'll get pain behind the eye and it'll get pain on movement. Believe it or not, dry eye, just on one side, can cause an ache uh, in the eye. But probably sinusitis, sinus problems are probably one of the number one problems for an ache behind the eye. Tension headaches, okay, can also cause this. So a type of a headache can be behind the eye, and it can be for a prolonged period of time. Graves disease, all right? So if he has a thyroid problem, uh, you can get an ache that starts more behind one eye. Even a tooth problem, you know? If he has some sort of, uh, you know, tooth infection or something uh, on an upper, uh, upper, whatever those are called, those big teeth. Um, <laughs> uh, not my area of expertise. So there's a whole host of things that can cause pain behind the eye. And it needs to be addressed, okay? If it has not gone away, it needs to be addressed. And I'd say the first thing is get into an optometrist and ophthalmologist immediately. We can determine if it is truly eye care related. And we can also help determine and rule out if it's potentially a neurological problem, something behind the eye, like a brain tumor or something compressing behind the eye. So we've got to rule out the potential, you know, harmful, serious aspects of this pain it's probably something fairly simple, like a sinusitis, uh, a tension headache. But if we don't check, we don't know. So he needs to get in and see somebody. I'd be happy to see him. But if he doesn't want to see me, he's got to go see somebody soon. Okay. Very good. I will see him tomorrow morning. I will encourage him again. All righty. Thank you. Well, you, you also say that you were clocking at 627 and everybody else was clocking at 630. That means you were out in front of the past day, man. Yeah, I, I did quite well. I had uh, one of the faster lap times. I got to tell you, remember, this is the first time I've been on a, on a uh, real track except during the school when I went to the Bondurant Race Schools. Uh, and so I was prepared pretty good. Um, I was real proud, you know. I was, I was passing the Ferraris and the McLarens and the Porsches, and uh, I don't think I ever got passed. <laughs> 
Yeah. Does your machine have a wing on the back of it? Oh, yeah, it's got a big wing. It's got 2,000 pounds of downforce. The faster you go, the better it handles. So uh, you, you can take some turns, amazing speeds with this because of all the downforce, the way this car has been designed. I mean, they... I thought I saw you coming up first 75 last, or, or last Tuesday. You went by so fast, I didn't have a chance to hold in on it, but I thought that was... Well, you probably did. I was breaking the car in. Yeah, I had to put a 750 miles on the car before I tracked it, so I had to drive it on the street. <laughs> right. Hey, Bob. Hi, Dr. Ray. Thank you. Thank you. All right, you're listening to Ask the Doctor. I'm Dr. Michael Lang. I've been hosting this show since April of 1993. We used to have a drive time show here in Tampa Bay uh, on, you know, Monday through Saturday. The only day I had to head off was Sunday. So now we just do it on Saturdays. So remember, you can always check us out at NewstalkFlorida.com. Write that down because you never know. Montgomery, Atlanta, or some of these radio stations. If I'm not on those stations, you know, we do a lot of test markets, and then we go to different uh, different channels. So if I'm not on your station, you can always pick me up at NewstalkFlorida.com. Or you can go to DrMichaelLang.com. That's the website. You can always find out what's going on there, DrMichaelLang.com. Uh, my social media is on there. You can uh, link to the radio shows and things like that. All right, let's go back to the phones. We've got a few people holding uh, on here. Let's see. I think... Uh, Steve on line three. Steve in Clearwater. Or whoever's on this line in Clearwater. Good morning. It's Steve in Bradenton. Oh, Steve in Bradenton. Okay, I got all right, I got another Steve on Clearwater. We got a lot of Steve's. Hey, right, Steve in Bradenton. Good morning. How many horsepower is that car got? Uh, 700. Wow. <laughs> Pick them up and lay them down. Yeah, that's all we need. But I'm thinking about adding a little bit more. Get a little more top at speed on the back straightaway. But I don't think I need it yet. Put a bigger turbo in there, I guess, or something. <laughs> so what's going on? How's your eye, how are your eyes doing today? Oh, half. You know, it's, my question was when you get the Avastin shots about every six weeks, and right before you're due for the next one. Is there a propensity for your eyesight to diminish just a little bit? Yep, there usually is. Remember, anytime you do an injection in the eye, it can create some temporary inflammation, okay? And so the actual injection can create a little pain, a little redness, a little irritation, a little inflammation, a little blurred vision, and everybody reacts differently to that. Some people have no problems at all. Some people have some dramatic problems, so it takes a little bit of time. And then remember, you know, you got, you know, just said we've been talking for a long time. You got, you know, two great doctors at your disposal. So if something is occurring and it just doesn't seem right to you, things aren't clearing up as quickly or things are getting worse, you know, your doctor should be on call 24 7. And, you know, it's a good idea to always contact them. Well, my question was, was right before you do for your next shot, do you tend to get blurry? Well, a lot of people do, absolutely, because then what's happening, these avastin injections have what we call anti-VEGF activity. In layman's terms, it actually can lower inflammation in the eye and lower irregular blood vessels from growing and leaking, which causes inflammation in your retina and swelling. So, uh, in theory, what happens is they have to continuously do these injections to keep those blood vessels kind of quiet, all right? Uh, because what happens after about six weeks, then they start to go back to their, their the way they are, starting to create some swelling of the retina. So they inject you again, and the swelling goes back down. And, you know, i got to tell you, Steve, it wasn't too long ago that you would have been totally blind by now if we didn't have those injections. You know, we used to have lasers that actually destroyed the retina to try to preserve the retina, which is kind of a catch-22. And so these injections have been a godsend. So this combined... As you know, you've been listening to the show with proper diet, proper supplementation, lifestyle adjustments, all of that is very powerful. So the injections by themselves are not good, just like the you know the proper nutrition. you got to combine everything. Yeah, I've lost uh, 56 pounds. I'm down to the lowest I've been for years now. I thought that might help, too. Now, what period of time have you lost that weight? Uh, it was in February when I started. Fantastic. That's probably one of the best things in the world that you could have done is losing that weight. And, you know, it's going to take time. I mean, you've had some serious problems with your eyes, so it's going to take time. And the main thing is they want to stabilize this. You're doing everything you can. They're doing everything they can. Um, and then, you know, a little prayer isn't going to hurt either. Yeah. All right. Thank you, Doctor. I sure appreciate it. All right. Steve, hang in there. 
Okay, see you later. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. Uh, Steve's been a caller for a while. I feel like I really know him quite well. He is hanging in there. Very poor vision in one eye and not so great vision in the other eye, but he's hanging in there. All right, phone lines are open, 866-977-4820. 866-977-4820. Now we're going to go to the Steve I thought I had. Let's see. Is this Steve in Clearwater? Yeah, I'm, I, and I'm not his twin either. <laughs> and, that's, and one thing, you're right, prayer helps. It, uh, there's an actual physics that occurs uh, uh, that uh, when people pray for people, this isn't religious, it's scientific. We know now that it actually does help people, just having good thoughts. So Amen. I pray for Steve, okay? It really works. I'm sure you've seen it happen. Absolutely. Um, I was going to ask, the cornea is the only tissue in the body that does not vascularize. And... There must be something that the cornea produces. You can tell me why I'm wrong on this. Um, that prevents the infiltration of vasculature into the cornea. Now, that when you give an avastin shot, you're trying to inhibit that 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 process in the in the retina. Is there any way that we that you could take a, an extract from, let's say, cow's corneas or human corneas, for that matter, or any corneas? And that chemical, whatever prevents the vascularization of the cornea, hmm. would prevent the vascularization or be act like an avastin shot. You follow what I'm saying? Yeah, that's interesting. So, and, uh, that's, uh, you know, an avastin shot, and, you know, that type of anti vegf activity doesn't work in the cornea due to, you know, no blood vessels. Now, i got to tell you, the cornea can develop something called neovascularization, and that is a disease entity. That means there's something going wrong. And that's notorious for contact lens wearers. They overwear their contacts. They sleep in their contacts. It deprives their eye of oxygen. So what happens is these irregular cor- uh, blood vessels from the sclera and the conjunctiva will grow into the cornea, trying to feed the cornea, and that is bad news. And like you mentioned, unlike most an ischemic uh, reaction to right. trying to... Oh, that's cool. And so most tissue in the body, as you know, uh, has a vascular blood vessels to nourish and protect against infection. Uh, the cornea doesn't. It receives its, its nourishment, basically. It's, it's oxygen and, and nutrients from the tears, all right, on the outside, and the aqueous humor in the inside. And so uh, it's interesting that there is no uh, vasculature there, but that's the way it feeds... Um, is from the tears and from the cornea. I got to think about that. Uh, that you uh, just talked about. It's an interesting topic. Because there must be something that the cornea produces to block the block that vascularization, and and and, and uh, you know because the, the, the vasculature would be a, a regular tissue. I don't know. I'm not really sure what I'm talking about. But <laughs> anyway, I have another question. Real quick, yeah. um, I, w- when you wear blue blockers and look at the sky, what color do you see? Uh, well, if it's a true blue blocker, it's going to be grayish color. You're not going to see any uh-huh. blue color. You're not going to well, see blue color. Would that be dangerous to wear when you're driving? Because if someone would come, yes. let's say you're driving and it's dark, it, it's it's dusk, not dark. Nobody drives with them on a red star. But someone comes in front of you with a a blue car comes in front of you. Yeah, it would just look like a gray car. Now, I wouldn't say that's a problem. But here's, but here's the problem. The blue blocker, a true blue blocker, 100% blue blocker lens is a sunglass. It's kind of orange in color. And remember, a green light has blue hues inside it, all right, okay. made up of blue. And you can't see that green light. It's not the right color. And so it can be dangerous. So it's not a good idea to wear blue blockers when you're driving your car. Okay. Because you might go right through that light and, you know, get T-boned, and that's not a good thing. Okay. So. Um, the, good, the lens that we created that I worked on for, you know, a few years is called Blue Light Defense. Now, Blue Light Defense blocks all the harmful blue light, okay? The most damaging blue light is between 400 and 430 nanometers. 411 nanometers is the worst for the retina. This blocks 99.9% of 411 nanometers. But it lets the other blue colors that are in 450, 60, 70, it lets about 80% of that through so you still see the blue color, okay? And also, uh, if you wear a blue blocker all day long, then your melatonin levels are going to start to be secreted early in the day and you're going to get tired. So it works to be, you have to have a selective blue blocker so you're not tired all day long, Okay. And that's why we develop Blue Light Defense. And you can learn a lot more if you just go to the website, bluelightdefense.com. And I am putting this in children now because, you know, we are starting to see 
uh, we're starting, Steve, we're starting to see kids, very young people, I mean, 18, 19, 20, 23 year olds, that are developing these macular changes that we've never seen before. And now we're thinking a lot of it is related to the blue light. They're on their iPhone, they're on their iPad, the computer all day long. And so, but this blue light is causing some damage uh, to, to the retina. And so, when we go in and get our eyeglasses made, always ask them to put the blue filtering lens in. The problem with this is most blue filtering lenses on the market right now are only filtering about 12%, 13%. So if you ask for blue light defense, and if they don't have it, go someplace else or tell them to set up an account with blue light defense. And there's a couple others. Kodak just came out with a very good lens. I forgot what it's called. But Kodak has a lens that blocks the blue light as well. So between Kodak and blue light defense, and those are the top lenses on the market right now. Oh, that's really cool. Well, you know, I think that there's that lens, that blue blockers. I'm not going to do it now because I've used a lot of your time. I'll call it in a week or two. Mm -hmm. But you know the depression that people get when they can't see? Yes. Yes. It's, 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 it, I think that's caused by the same reason that the blue blockers help you produce melatonin. I really think uh, these could be a good antidepressant. Yep, you do. I, I, I don't want to go into the long theory of why, but I, I'll call you in a couple of weeks and tell you why I think it would work. No, no, you have a valid point there. People do get depressed if, if they're not getting sunshine. The sunshine is not going in into their eye, telling their brain to secrete or not secrete melatonin. Their whole circadian rhythm, the whole sleep cycle, starts to get screwed up. I'm thinking about epinephrine. Yeah, and that's you're you're, you're right on line with that. And depression follows suit, absolutely. But the reason why is because you know I've been homeless, as you know, and mm -hmm. I, you know when you're when you're fighting every day just to survive, you 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 get depressed. And I noticed when I wore a, a, uh, that, I, I didn't quite get that big. And I, I know it sounds totally ridiculous, <laughs> but I swear to God, it worked. And so, anyway. Yeah, we, uh, we get, let's talk about that another time. Yeah. yeah. Okay, well, God bless, and thanks for taking your time with me. Steve, you hang in there, buddy. All right, we get a lot of great callers. All right, phone lines are open, 1-866-977-4821, 866 977 you are listening to Ask the Doctor. Uh, remember, if you're not happy with the eye care that you're getting, get a second opinion. You know, we're blessed to have a lot of great optometrists and ophthalmologists throughout the country. Uh, just get in to see one of them. Remember, an eye exam is one of the best forms of preventative medicine we have today. When you're looking through the eye, when a good eye doctor is looking in your eye, we're not only looking for the first signs of diseases of the eye, like glaucoma and cataracts, macular degeneration. We're looking for retinal holes and retinal tears. But believe it or not, some of the first telltale signs of general health problems, pending strokes, brain tumors, all right, arterial sclerosis, atherosclerosis, thyroid problems, uh, hypertension, diabetes, elevated cholesterol, these things can show up in the eye. And the key is early detection. Also, if you're a diabetic, it is crucial to have an annual eye exam. If your diabetes isn't under good control, twice a year. Because the eye doctor can see if your blood sugar, you know, your doctor might think your blood sugar at 110 or 115 is good for you. But if you have leaky microaneurysms in your eye and you have progressive myopic changes and diabetic cataracts, then that blood sugar needs to be lower. By the same token, same thing with blood pressure. We can see if the vasculature system in your body is handling your health issues. So an eye doctor, whether it's an ophthalmologist, an optometric physician, an optometrist, combined with your primary care physician, is a very, very good team approach. Once again, the Lang Eye Institute, we have one of the largest uh, uh, total eye care centers in the state of Florida. Uh, the building is close to 35,000, 36,000 square feet. And we do everything from major surgery, nutritional intervention, glasses, contact lenses, medical treatment. We have plastic surgery, retina, uh, glaucoma. We have it all under one roof at the Lang Eye Institute in the villages. People come from all over, all over the country to see us, and mostly for our nutritional knowledge on eye care. Uh, we're doing a lot uh, with patients that have dry eye and nutrition, macular degeneration and nutrition, glaucoma and nutrition. Now, certainly these diseases we treat medically and surgically, but we use proper nutrition, dietary adjustments, lifestyle adjustments, proper supplementation uh, as, as, as a way to work in concert with traditional medical therapy. So I never recommend a glaucoma patient doing it naturally and alternatively. You will go blind, trust me. So that's one area that you have to use uh, traditional medical therapy. There's some gl great glaucoma medications, 
great procedures that we do in the office that can help glaucoma patients. All right, uh, phone lines are open, one 877 4820 Waiting for the first call from Atlanta, Georgia. That's WGST, Montgomery, Alabama, 866-977-4820. Remember, Fortify Vitamins. Learn about the vitamins. I've been working on these. I've changed most of these formulas 15, 16 times over the last 10 years. Nobody does that. I'm a perfectionist. I want the best for my patients, my family, my friends, my loved ones. So that's why I've developed these supplements, not to get rich, but to actually have something that works, a legitimate therapeutic effect. So you'll constantly see these supplements evolving. I like to give specials for people out there to, in order to, to, to try some of the products. The newest stuff that we've developed is is called Fortify Super Protein and Fortify Blue Green Superfood. The combination of those, you can put them in milk, almond milk, goat milk, uh, coconut milk, shake them up, a scoop of each, drink it down. That's a complete meal. People are losing weight by, by using this as a meal replacement. But i got to talk about protein. A lot of you are taking proteins. You need to be taking a whey protein concentrate, okay? The concentrate has the fats that are good for you that stimulate your immune system. Covalent bonded cysteine is in there that's, that stimulates glutathione much better than an isolate, okay? And then you have lactoferrin. You have CLA. These things stimulate your immune system and help detoxify your body. A whey protein concentrate is the way to go. It is the most bioactive form of protein at any age. Children, great, great grandparents should all be taking a protein like this. The problem is most whey protein concentrates that you buy, they don't say where it comes from. That means it probably comes from China. And I would not put a Chinese protein in my body, so you should not either. So if it doesn't say where it comes from, I wouldn't take it, number one. Number two, most protein that you have has been denatured. It's been heated to a very high level, over 300 degrees, denaturing the protein so you're almost not getting the effects that you should. Also, most proteins, you didn't know this, you learned it here on Ask the Doctor, have been bleached, all right? To get the dye from the cheese out of it, they bleach it, and they're using benzoyl peroxide. Google that and see what it does to your overall health. So most proteins that you're consuming may be doing more harm than good, so be very careful. If it says it comes from New Zealand, New Zealand is the safest place to get your protein, just like omega-3 fish oil. The safest place is Norway. That's where we develop our fortified super omega. So New Zealand whey protein is the safest. They don't use any dyes in their cheese. They don't use any bleach in their proteins. So that's where we get our whey protein, our super protein from. We have a vanilla flavor, chocolate flavor, and a naked protein that has no guar gum and no flavor at all. So that's become very popular for the purists out there. But we use organic cocoa and organic vanilla in our um, in our proteins and very small amounts of stevia, the organic stevia, uh, just to make it a little more flavorful and tasty. Remember, stevia doesn't have any calories, any carbohydrates. It's natural and it's very safe. So if you don't, it's not one of those that likes stevia for whatever reason, then you go to our naked protein that has nothing in it. So learn more about this. You can go to uh, fortify.com and remember, Take the summer code. It's just summer, S-U-M-M-E-R, and put it in fortify.com. You know, go ahead and put in a fortify blue-green superfood and a fortify vanilla or chocolate uh, super protein. Boom, you get 30% off. That's a good deal. You try it, you will love it. If you live near the Ocala, Florida area, come into our fortify uh distribution center there. The front part of it, the back part's all warehouse. The front part is a little retail area. And you can go in and try it. They can put it in almond milk, coconut milk, and water. They'll mix it up for you. And you'll get a free lunch, free breakfast, free supper on us. You try it before you buy it. So go in and see my pals, uh, see Mandy, Danny, Miss Nita over at Fortify. I'm going to give you the phone number for Fortify. That is 866 503 97 Four, six. four to five vitamins is 866-503-9746. And remember, uh, it is fortify.com. All right. Um, we're probably going to take a break here shortly. I think we've got another phone call we're going to take. And then, depending on the phone, uh, we are going to take a break. But phone lines are open, 866-977-4820. 866-977-4820. Let me know if we're coming in loud and clear. Montgomery, Alabama and or Atlanta, Georgia. 
because I know we're coming through um, loud and clear just about everywhere in Florida. So one more time, 866-977-4820. Also, I had somebody just text me. <laughs> a lot of people don't want to be heard over the radio, and they email me, they text me, and wanting to know, uh, patient has dry eyes, I have dry eyes, what is the best contact lens for dry eyes? There's a lot of good contacts for dry eyes. The number one thing is try to get your dry eye under control. When we talk about dry eye, we usually do four things. Heat the lids, clean the lids, neutrify the glands with omega-3 fish oil, and lubricate with Oasis Tears Plus or Blink Tears. You can get all that at the Fortify website. So get your dry eye under control. If you got your dry eye control, you don't have your dry eye under control. I like Bausch and Lomb. Bausch and Lomb Ultra, Bausch and Lomb Ultra series of contacts. I think is the best in the market for dry eye or non-dry eye patients. Amazing optics. They make them spherical, astigmatic, and multifocals. So Bausch and Lomb really has done a good job. The Ultra series contact lenses you can't get away with them. Uh, you can't get any better. So that's what I recommend for dry eye patients. All right, let's go to the phone. I think it's Joe. Joe and Lutz, good morning. Hey, Dr. Lane, how you doing? All right, and yourself? Okay, I have a couple questions there. The first one is, can you refer me to a good naturopathic doctor? A good, I, you're kind of breaking up a little bit. A good naturopathic doctor? Absolutely, I can. And uh, I can mention one right on the radio here. I mean, the guy that we use is upstairs in the Lang Eye Institute, Dr. Joe. Oh, Right upstairs, Dr. John Pawlatsky. He's amazing. So I, I, just, I just call the Lang Eye Institute and make an appointment with him? Yeah, you can call there, uh, but they, they, we'd have to give you his number. Um, I would have to, uh, I can give you that information. If you email me uh, at idude92 at icloud.com or at aol.com, either way. So just I do. that's E Y E. D U D E ninety two at iCloud.com or AOL.com, either one. Just shoot me an email saying I'll give you all of this information. I'll link it to his website and all that stuff. Thank you very much. All right. Uh, with, uh, I have a research, I have a honey. I just, I'm, um, it's a research that it can be done naturally. What, does he do that, you know? Oh, yeah, yeah. He, anything and everything from a natural yeah, approach, he has an idea. Like, is it an inguinal hernia, an umbilical yeah, hernia? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Those you, you have to be careful with because you don't want them to strangulate and cause a problem. Yeah, I know. <laughs> and I, I really don't want a surgery because it'll, you know, it'll transform faster than I have with the, uh, the webbing and stuff. Right, right. Well, I had, I had an umbilical hernia from Mason Motocross that I got uh, in a race, geez, about nine years ago, and I felt when it happened. And, you know, I just started getting in better shape, started working my abs out, losing some weight. It's gone. And the surgeon said, you've got to have that fixed right away. Uh, and it's gone. It has no problems. Uh, and, you know, got down to my ideal body weight and, and started working out, working out my abs and things like that. So that's a little bit that's different. Right. That's a little bit that's different. Right. He can help me with that, right? Yeah, he can. He, can he's, he does some amazing things. So I think okay. certainly it's a good idea to have him in your corner. Okay, thanks for having me. Now I have a couple of nutritional questions. Right. I take I take all your stuff, the um, the one a day complete super omega ultra super protein lupine super food. Right, right. Do I get all? I will not have any deficiencies in nutrition if I take all that. Right. You should not have any deficiencies. Remember, I developed this based on intracellular blood analysis that we did on literally you know thousands of patients. And in the developmental stages, you know, I would put patients on the supplement. Six months later, we'd draw three vials of blood, and we would check it. And it took about eight years to get to the point where we're at now. Now I'm just fine-tuning it because it wasn't always like that. You take the vitamin, you still had nutritional deficiencies. So as long as you don't have some sort of, you know, serious disease that's causing you to have problems and intestinal problems and things like this, then, yes, this should be plenty. You should be getting antioxidants that are extremely bioavailable, protein that's bioavailable, you know, organic whole foods. I mean, you should be doing pretty doggone good. You should be living for, you know, up into your hundreds. <laughs> okay. Uh, or, uh, on your website, so you have now a curcumin product. Right, right. Is that, is that as good as curcumin? No, nope, no, nope, I'll, I'll be honest with you, it's not. The best curcumin product, in my opinion, on the market right now is called curcumin. Right. Because it, all the new studies that just came out 
Um, it, it shows that it's 48, t- bi- 48 times more bioavailable than the next bio, most bioavailable in the market. And so that's great because the you curcumin, know? yeah, even even the one that we have on our website, yep. So uh, it's going to be a little bit more expensive. Um, yeah. And so um, yes, it's the most bioavailable in the market. And, you know, I'm, I'm talking with these people about getting licensing and maybe getting it under the Fortify label. So we'll see what happens down the road. Okay, uh, and one last question. Mm-hmm. So I won't be getting enough iodine taking all that stuff for years, right? Well, um, you know, you, you should not be concerned, I don't think, about an iodine deficiency. I mean, do you have any thyroid problems? Well, I'm just trying to avoid it. Right. <laughs> yeah, you, you, you should be fine. You really should be. And now remember, oh. you got to eat well. you got to eat five small meals a day with plenty of fruits and vegetables and try to eat as organically as you can. Okay. So don't just depend on the fortified by itself. <laughs> yeah, no, I, yeah, well, I eat. Eat well. I, try, I don't eat anything out of a box or a bag. That's the one thing. Fantastic. Okay, Dr. Thank you very much. Have a great day. All right, hang in there. Joe's a good man. He'll live a long, healthy, healthy life. All right, let's see. we got a lot of people loading up. I don't think we're going to take a break. Let's see. Uh, da, 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 let's see, maybe. I don't know who's next. I think it's uh, number three. Uh, let's see. Tony, uh, I'm not even sure where you're from. Holiday, Florida, maybe, or I'm not sure. Hey, Dr. Ryan, it's R.P. Tony. Hey, more than a while. Yeah. It's been a couple of years. Yes, it has been. Absolutely. Yeah, uh, any new discoveries on the R.P. retinitis pigmentosa? Well, i got to tell you, uh, one of the, a pretty exciting thing. The only FDA-approved bionic eye in the United States right now, I think it's called Argus 2. And this is a, they've been using it with patients with RP, retinitis pigmentosa. I don't recommend it yet, but this is basically a bionic eye. They use a microchip they implant in your retina, a pair of glasses that has a little tiny camera on it, and it actually is, is doing pretty interesting things. These patients are patients that have virtually no vision. They're getting able, you know, they're seeing they're seeing images, they're seeing motions and things like this. So they're taking people that are blind and giving them vision. And right now, the electrodes in the implant, I think, I'm, I, I, no, I haven't been looking at this as carefully as I should, but I think they have like 16 to 30 electrodes. So therefore, the acuity, the sharpness of the vision isn't where it will be. But when they get 100 electrodes and then 1,000 electrodes and a million electrodes, I mean, I got to tell you, in your lifetime, uh, in the not so distant future, I think we're going to be taking really people out of the darkness and giving some real usable vision. And I'm thinking it's going to happen here over the next, in, in the next five years. Thank you. That's what you were telling me back in like four or five years ago. Mm-hmm. You've been in my lifetime. In the, in the meantime, in the meantime, you know, omega three in the triglyceride form, which is our fortified super omega. Uh, lutein and zeaxanthin, those are very important. So something like our Fortify Focus combined with the Fortify Super Omega, you got to keep your body healthy, you got to keep your brain healthy, so that when we do have something, you know, remember you see with the brain, the eye is just the organ that transmits it to the brain. So you still have to be keeping it in as good shape as possible. And plenty of saltate spinach. You got it. Organic spinach, preferably, and cooked, cook, steamed, or juiced, not raw, and baby spinach. So, baby organic spinach or baby organic kale. Okay. All right. All right. Thank you, Dr. Ryan. Have a great weekend. Take care. All right. 866-977-4820. 866-977-4820. I'm getting kind of hungry. I might have one of these Paleo Simplified bars right now. My favorite is actually the chocolate coconut almond. Chocolate coconut almond, but one called pecan pie is actually pretty good, too. You can actually get these as a local place here in Clearwater, Nature's Food Patch. So everybody knows that place. Great, organic, uh, kind of like a Whole Foods. It's actually, in my opinion, better. Go to Nature's Food Patch right there downtown Clearwater, um, and you can get the Paleo bars there. Paleo Simplified. So don't accept anything but that. Paleo Simplified. Check out the pecan pie, chocolate coconut almond. Also, the, the coconut, uh, the um, honey nut crunch is amazing. You can put that on your cereal. Just eat it right out of the bag. Um, you can also get these at paleosimplified.com, Amazon, fortify.com, and remember also at uh, Fortify headquarters right there in Ocala, Florida. All right, let's go back to the phones. Andy in Fort Myers, good morning. Good morning, Dr. Ryan. I wanted to give you and your listeners a heads up if you didn't catch or talk about the uh, 
news story, uh, a national news story last week about the new uh, smartphone, smartphone from Samsung. I think it's the 8. Um, it's causing dizziness and eye pain in, in owners of the new smartphone by Samsung. Um, it, it scans your uh, iris, I believe. Right. And that's the cause of the, uh, the pain. I wanted to get your reaction to that. Wow, you know, I had just, I haven't even learned enough about that, but I do know that it is an iris scanner, and uh, I got I to gotta read up on that, and we got to talk about it next week. I'm totally clueless, and I don't say that very often, so I'm glad you brought that up. I will read up on that, and then determine what's going on, and we'll discuss it next week. Yeah, and in general, maybe if you could talk about the, the whole uh, move in the technology field to doing these eye scans as opposed to using a password, I, I, don't, I, don't, I can't see how that could be healthy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, and it depends on what they're scanning, you know, what kind of scanning laser they're using and what kind of frequency of light they're using. You would think and you would hope that they're using a frequency that's safe, uh, but you never know. It's all about money. So um, if they're going to make a lot of money, it doesn't matter what your health, uh, what kind of health problems you could potentially have. So I'm going to look into that, and we're going to talk about it next week. So I'm glad you brought that up, Andy. You, you, you well, stay on top of things. Well, thank you. All right. All, all else is well with you? Yeah. Yeah, I'm good, good to talk to you. Fantastic. All right. Okay. You, you take care of yourself. Okay. Bye. Bye-bye. All right. I'm glad I'm using an iPhone right now, and I still got the old-fashioned way of actually putting in the uh, uh, special code. So I'm going to have to write that down, uh, Samsung, the new Samsung Iris. Activity. All right, phone lines are open, 866-977-4820. That's 866-977-4820. Uh, maybe we will take a break here in just a second. got to go get a quick glass of water, um, so I'm getting parched. So I'll be back in about eh, two and a half minutes. Stay tuned. <laughs> Michael Lang. I'm a board certified optometric physician and a certified nutritional specialist. Did you know that the majority of vitamins that you can buy over the counter are filled with synthetic nutrients, dyes, and trans fats? All of the things that are bad for you. This is why I developed Fortify Vitamins, an all natural nutraceutical developed over years of clinical research. Fortify Complete Plus is equivalent to 10 to 12 servings of fruits and vegetables a day. This supplement is a multivitamin, eye vitamin, veggie and fruit blend with enzymes and omega-3 fish oil, developed to promote total body wellness and healthy vision. Isn't it time that you took control of your health with Fortify Vitamins? Take control of your health with Fortify. Learn more and order now at www.fortify.com. Available at Lang Eye Care and Associates. All omega-3 is not created equal. Hi, I'm Dr. Michael Lang. You hear a lot of commercials that promote omega-3 products. It may be confusing. Most large studies confirming the positive health benefits of omega-3 were done with fish or fish oil. As founder of Lang Eye Care and a doctor in search of what's best for my patients, I visited Norway on a research trip to develop Fortify Super Omega, the highest quality omega-3 fish oil available. Only wild-caught fish with the highest omega-3 content are used in this formula. Produced in Norway at the only NSF and GMP certified omega-3 facility in the world, Fortify Super Omega eliminates any odor or aftertaste. It promotes heart, brain, eye, and joint health. Fortify Super Omega has 1,600 milligrams of triple refined omega-3 fish oil compared to anything on the market. You won't find a more bioavailable form of omega-3. To purchase, go to fortify.com. That's F-O-R-T-I-F-E-Y-E dot com or call 866-503-9746. That's 866 866- If you or a loved one is suffering from macular degeneration, then take note of the following information. 
Hi, I'm Dr. Michael Lang. I'm a board certified optometric physician and a certified nutritional specialist. Masculine degeneration is the leading cause of blindness in patients over 55. I have personally seen thousands of patients with macular degeneration in clinical practice for over 17 years. I've seen the positive benefits that patients can realistically obtain through nutritional intervention and lifestyle modifications. I have developed a science-based nutraceutical called Fortify Complete Macular Defense. It takes all of the latest nutritional research and incorporates it into one convenient daily packet. There is hope for macular degeneration through proper nutrition. Isn't it time that you took control of your health to fortify complete macular defense? Learn more and order now at www.fortify.com. Available at Lang Eye Care and Associates. Welcome back. You're listening to Ask the Doctor. I'm your host, Dr. Michael Lang, board certified optometric physician and certified nutritional specialist here to answer your questions regarding your vision, eye care, and nutrition. Remember, this never takes the place of a medical evaluation or an eye examination. This is for educational purposes only. And you know, my attorneys will be happy. All right, I just want to mention a doctor down in Sunrise, Florida, Dr. Dan uh, Llewellyn at a place called Spectacles in Sunrise, Florida, now carries the entire line of four to five vitamins. So a lot of you down there in Sunrise, Florida, um, once again, that's Dr. Dan Llewellyn at Spectacles in Sunrise, Florida. They also carry the blue light defense lenses and uh, the entire line of four to five vitamins. Also, I want to mention Atlanta because we got a big listening audience in Atlanta, Georgia. Uh, in Atlanta, Georgia, there's a great eye group um, called Atlanta Eye Works. Or iWorks of Atlanta is what it's called. So iWorks of Atlanta, uh, they got three locations, Midtown, Brookhaven, and Decatur. Uh, they also carry the blue light defense lenses. So if you want to get the blue light defense lenses for your children, if you want to get them for yourself, you can go to blue light defense, do bluelightdefense.com. You can order those a Plano, no prescription. But if you want to get the prescription ones in Atlanta, uh, certainly go to um, iWorks of Atlanta. Uh, right there in Midtown, Brookhaven, and Decatur. In Gainesville, Florida, you can go to Quinn Eye Care. In Ocala, Florida, you can go to Clark Eye Care. And certainly the Lang Eye Institute, we handle blue light defense lenses there. Also, you can send us your prescription, and we can send you these lenses uh, anywhere, yeah, actually anywhere in the world. Also, Dr. John Podlowski, I actually got a phone number for him for those that wanted to see a naturopathic, chiropractic, certified uh, acupuncturist, I mean, he's even gone to medical school. Dr. John Podlotsky, his phone number is 352-801-0021. That's 352-801-0021. He's in the Lang Eye Institute upstairs uh, with his own uh, Natural Health Institute. All right, uh, now we got to take some phone calls. Let's see. Janet in Indian Rocks Beach, good morning. Thanks for holding. Yes, good morning. How are you doing? Fantastic. Good. Um, I just tuned in the last 10, 15 minutes. Um, I recently was down in West Palm Beach area. I have a sister there, mm -hmm. and uh, she was taking a very poor quality multiple vitamin mineral. Right. And so she asked me what I took, and of course I take all your things, okay? Right, right. And uh, anyway, uh, I told her about, you know, it up here in this area, and then also I called in Ocala, and the closest to her is near Jupiter around that area. Right. And uh, she said, I'm not uh, going to be bothering with mail and stuff. She said, I want to go to a place and just, you know, get what I want, you know? Exactly, exactly. Uh, okay, I don't know if you can help me out here or want to, but I told her, I said, I haven't taken those things for so long. I said, I, and I, we went to a big, the largest whole food store outside of Palm Beach. Right. And we stood there looking and looking. I said, all of them have vitamin E, which I, you know, Dr. Lane does not, you know, uh, endorse. Right, right, exactly. Is there any 
any brand out there that would come halfway decent for her to take. Could you help? Did you wow. I'd have to really research that. That's, that's the problem. That's why I started developing Fortify. The majority, the lion's share of, of multivitamin slash I vitamins on the market, you know, they're really, it's old technology. And probably they manufacture so many millions of bottles, they're trying to, you know, get rid of their inventory. And what they do, they get them relabeled and they put the expiration date out. They send them back, get them relabeled and put the expiration date out every two years. And they probably may manufacture so many of them that, uh, you know, the more you produce, then it's cheaper. So, um, most of them have beta carotene in them and vitamin A palmitate. Remember, beta carotene blocks the absorption of lutein, zeaxanthin, and astaxanthin. Yep. And if you're a smoker, beta carotene increases your risk of lung cancer. It's not good for men's prostate. And the same thing with vitamin A. Vitamin A palmitate, retinol. This is a fat soluble vitamin. As long as you're not a 100% vegetarian, uh, then you're not vitamin A deficient. So you don't need to be taking vitamin A. If you're eating fruits and vegetables, eating some animal products, then nobody in America is deficient in that. And so you're getting some stuff that's actually bad for you and can cause toxicities. And then most of those vitamins, if you look at them, they're filled with binders and trans fats. And the worst yet, they, they get dyes. Some of them have three different dyes in them. I don't know why they're putting these dyes in these vitamins. And that causes endocrine disruption. So you got to be very careful. Um, I looked at the, the really top-of-the-line better ones, but, as I said, they all have anywhere from 3,000 and up. I use a vitamin E right. and with the beta-carotene source, and yep. I was concerned because of what I've learned from you. Yeah. So I guess the really, the answer would probably be probably none of them, but, uh, right? Yeah, there's not a lot over the counter. I mean, she she doesn't like to order from, what, the Internet? She's not, no, no, she doesn't, she doesn't do that. Uh, she's... 73 years old, okay. Ah, she's still young. Come on. Yeah, that way she's kind of old fast, but anyway, she's, forget it. Just don't bother me. She just well, you can go, you know, a supplement to take, you know, like go to Whole Foods or they have health food stores there. She said, that's the way I want to go. I you could that. mail them to her. What? You could mail them to her. Well, that's a pain in the butt for me, too. But, uh. <laughs> right. I mean, I would, I, would, I would tell her to eat lots of fruits and vegetables, organically grown fruits and vegetables. She's going to Whole Foods, trying to load up on the outside of the aisle, you know, organically raised uh, free-range chickens and beef and, and wild Alaska salmon, lots of fruits and vegetables. And, and you know, maybe not uh, – I mean, she can get a good New Zealand whey protein at Whole Foods. It's just not – Ours that's non-bleached from AQ cows, but she could get something like that, and she could probably get a good superfood. But I wouldn't trust a lot of the vitamins that are over the counter. I really wouldn't. I know. I feel the same mm -hmm. way. All right, well, listen, I, I appreciate your time, and uh, I'll have to see what I'm going to do with her. <laughs> All right. You take care. Thank you. Bye-bye. All right, a lot of people on hold still. So uh, it's very simple to go to fortify.com, F-O-R-T-I-F-E-Y-E, fortify.com, get your stuff. Um, it, most people get it in one day, uh, shipped out of Florida, two days max. So you can call. A lot of people don't have Internet access that listen to this program. A lot of vision-impaired people listen to me for the last 25 years. So the phone number for Fortify Vitamins is 866 503 866 Five zero three nine seven four six. Also, there's a lot of good information uh, you can go to on my website, my personal website, and you can link to Blue Light Defense and Fortify Vitamins from my website. So everything goes to drmichaellang.com. And those of you that want to lose weight, go to drmichaellang.com. Go to the right-hand side, scroll down a little bit to news and information. Go to the Lang Diet Plan. Check it out. You can lose six pounds a week safely. If you follow the Lang Diet Plan, so go to drmichaellang.com, scroll down the right-hand side of the page, go to the Lang Diet Plan, check it out. All right, we're out of time. I'm sorry we couldn't get to all the calls. Uh, I'm Dr. Michael Lang. Have a great day, and God bless you.